A technology was presented at the pit last year um, uh, by a company that um, that was trying to really make a go of creating a device, and, in, and it's now been renamed a privacy hub, um, for people to be able to take this hub, log into it, and really disappear from any known tracking mechanisms, whether it's the government or the bad guys or anyone else who's trying to track you. Um, we have now taken that technology and built an entirely new uh, form factor, a new device uh, out, of the, out of that, uh, blended their software and a couple other uh, software offerings into what I believe is the most secure um, means to be on your cell phone. The challenge that cell phones has, you guys may remember from uh, um, from uh, 2000 Mules, is of course you know the 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 GIS comes into your phone, um, marks your location. That's then stamped along with the time onto various apps. Those apps then are sent back to the app owners. They're amalgamated and then sold. Um, and that's certainly one way to do it. There are all sorts of other ways that they can listen to your phone calls. They can listen to your text messages, um, can and do listen to your text messages. A lot of the things that we sort of all are lulled to sleep and believing are safe um, in terms of our browsers and and um, and these uh, messaging apps and and uh, what big tech's actually doing to us is really really pretty pretty significant in terms of its uh, um, danger. Uh, it's anti-freedom for certain, uh, but also it's violating uh, our privacy, your privacy, uh, the privacy of judges and law enforcement and, and families and kids and everybody else that uses cell phones. And, and it's, it's pretty frightening when you really get into the heart of it. Um, a couple of the big tech operators are mostly responsible for some of this. Uh, Google has a worldwide uh, patent that, um, in essence, allows them to collect all of these um, signals um, without even going through um, the traditional apps. And so it's, um, it's a pretty, pretty difficult um, uh, uh, situation in place that we find ourselves in. The second thing is uh, Apple has a, a mesh that they've created that allows them to not only bounce cell phone off a of cell phone, but cell phone into routers. And in places where GIS isn't showing up, if they know where the router is and they know how far you are from the router, then they basically know where you are. Um, and so there's lots of these things going on out there. And we are working um, uh, feverishly to um, get these devices um, um, uh, not just built, but um, uh, get a company launched that that uh, can, you know, can help uh, spread spread these far and wide. Um, Catherine and I've been working on this for almost a year. Um, we received our first uh, test set of advice, uh, devices and privacy hubs just in the last uh, couple of weeks, and then uh, today. In fact, uh, we received uh, the first big shipment. So we're working on that. You're going to hear a lot more about it. The name of the company is Cloak, K-L-O-K. Um, and um, Cloak is going to be um, on the, the minds and lips of a lot of folks in America, um, good and bad guys, um, uh, coming very soon.